Lisa, you were telling me before that Jeff Probst, the host of Survivor, is actually a fan of your cookies, which yes. is his favorite. He's a huge fan of the Howard Stern Show, and I have baked him chocolate chip cheesecake squares for both he and his dad. Mm. And wow. also I brought today my Fruity Pebbles cookies, which is an homage to a lovely guy that I dated, and he was so nice, I didn't know what to do right. with him. He turned out to be... Well, that was part of my issue, was that um, I, I would get a nice guy, and, and then what, he was boring to me, and I liked the bad guys, uh, right? Oh, the oh, married yes. men, the guys who weren't available. I thought you were going to say the guy turned out to be Fruity Pebbles, <laughs> hey, which is why you... you can use Banana Nut Crunch, you can use any type of cereal, okay. Captain Crunch. So what you do is it's very easy. You cream the butter and the sugar. So we have a stick of butter. Stick of butter. We have brown sugar, and we have white sugar, and we also have. We'll put. You also put in a little bit of vanilla, and then you're going to mix extract. this all okay. in together. And when that's all stirred up together, you add your egg. Okay. Right. Oops, got oh, a little messy there. Put that right in there. Okay. And then in this bowl, if you want, you could put your flour. Your flour. And right here, and your baking soda. Here. All right. Oh, in this, this bowl. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, yeah, dry ingredients. Oh, yeah, my bad. Dry my ingredients. This is why you have the book, and I <laughs> right. have the show. Yeah. And so you know, we're going to be mixing all this up like this, and then we're going to add the dry ingredients to the wet ingredients. Got it. And ideally, maybe a hand mixer, a little electric yes, hand, hand mixer would make this. Yes, I use a hand mixer very quickly. I have a great upright mixer, which is fantastic, it's like a piece mixer. of jewelry. And this is what the dough looks like. Okay. And so we had two cups of fruity pebbles. We divided into two, so we put a cup mm -hmm. of fruity pebbles into the mixed dough. You can add it like that. And you mix it up like this, and then you start scooping. Whoops! Ooh. Doesn't matter. One thing about you know they cereal right and cookie dough, people are afraid of cookies, and the problem is, and what I tell everyone is, that just don't cook them too much. Undercook them a little bit. Okay. And um, they end up cooking more on the cookie sheet. So Seems like for those people who have already uh, like this. Found and then you add a little more of the fruity pebbles on top. Ah. So See? this is for the nice guy. This is for the nice, the nice guys guy gets in your life. <laughs> Look, if your uh, boyfriend at the time's being a bit of a jerk, you could use apple jack cookies, you know. There you go. Uh, you know, apple jack there filling. And then you take it like this and just top it, see? Wow. And so then you bake them in the oven, and we have some finished. Do we? So, uh, this, so these bake for how long? About uh, 350 for about, what, yeah, 10, 12 like minutes? Yeah, 10 minutes or so. Right. You know, right. everyone's oven is different. You're getting yeah. your domestic skills I know, I'm gonna really, take, I know. really I'm, in shape. I'm going to take that. Oh, so please do. Yeah, so you don't burn yourself. It's a little warm. This is good. Oh, there's the uh, mitt. Look at Andrea getting I know, her domestic me. skills <laughs> on. It's amazing. <laughs> right, they're easy. Things. All right, okay, and then here and, comes the, the sheet oh, of finished yeah. cookies. And so you've got to taste because they are so delicious. I'm surprised they don't burn. The fruit, they don't burn. They don't burn at all. Well, I like to undercook. The cookies a little bit because, right. like I said, they still continue to bake while they're on the cookie sheet. Right. And that's the biggest fear that people have is like, oh my God, I'm not good at baking cookies because they burn on the bottom and then they don't taste well. But these, I think, are delicious and so much fun, right? Yeah. They are. Look how colorful they are. How long like do you suggest after you got the guy? Let's say you get the guy. When do you start that introducing these? That is a great question. Do you have a how to keep a guy I'd, cookie? That's what I okay, need. Okay, I'd say once you uh, introduce the word boyfriend into the conversation, then you can bake them cookies. Before then, no way. Mm -hmm. They should be taking you out to dinner. They should be whining and dining and you. All these and rules. And then give them rules. cookies. I'm so glad to be married. Anytime I hear, <laughs> anytime I hear these rules. Uh, thank you so much, Lisa. These uh, are really you. fun recipes. We'll put all these recipes up on our website, bettertv.com. You can also find them in Sex, Lies, and Cookie, Lisa G's book.